Hello students, let's do simple linear equations, exercise 14c. So let's work out what's on the left hand side first. So we have x minus 1 by 2 minus x minus 2 by 3 minus x minus 3 by 4. So let's work this out. First, let's find the LCM of 2, 3 and 4, the denominators. So beginning with 2, 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4. Again, you continue with 2. Now we can go on to 3. So we get 1 each. So the LCM is equal to 2 into 2 into 3. 2 2s are 4, 4 3s are 12. So 12 is our LCM. Now let's use this. 2 6s are 12, so we have to multiply the whole numerator by 6. So 6 into x is 6x minus 6 ones are 6. Now we have minus before the bracket and let's continue. 3 4s are 12, so we have to multiply this numerator by 4. Since we have minus before the bracket, we're going to continue to put our brackets. 4 into x is 4x. And 4 into minus 2 is minus 8. Minus, again, we're going to use brackets here. 4, 3s are 12. So let's multiply this whole thing by 3. 3 into x is 3x minus 3, 3s are 9. Now let's open the brackets. So we have 6x minus 6. Now when you see minus before a bracket, the sign of all the terms inside will change. So minus 4x plus 8. Again, we have minus, so change the sign. Minus 3x plus 9. Now, all this divided by 12. Now, let's work on the like terms. We have 6x, then we have minus 4x, and we have minus 3x. So, let's work on that. So, 6x minus 4x minus 3x. So, that is 6 minus 4 minus 3x. So, we write 6 as it is. Let's work on the numbers with the same sign. When signs are the same, put the same sign and add 4 plus 3 is 7. So that is 7x. Now again, signs are different. 1 is plus, 1 is minus. So put the sign of the bigger number and subtract. 7 minus 6 is 1. So we have 1x here. So this is equal to 1x. Now we have to work on the whole numbers. So our whole numbers are minus 6 we have. Then we have plus 8 and then we have plus 9. So let's, let's work on that. Minus 6 plus 8 plus 9. So we'll write minus 6 as it is. And let's take these numbers with the same sign. Signs are the same. So put the same sign and add. 8 plus 9 is 17. Again, here the signs are different. So put the sign of the bigger number and subtract. 17 minus 6 is 11. So here we have 1x plus 11 by 12. So let's write that here. So we have 1x plus 11 by 12 equals 0. So 1x or x itself, x plus 11 will be 0 into 12 because we have transposed 12 from here to the right hand side. So so remember, this is minus x. So I put the minus sign there now. So minus x is equal to 0 into 12 is 0 minus 11 because I'm transposing plus 11 to the right hand side. It's become minus 11. So now the value of x minus x is equal to minus 11. So to find the value of x, we say x is equal to 11. So this is our answer x is 11. Question 22. Now let's work out what's on the left hand side first. So we have x plus 1 by 3. Let's write that down. x plus 1 by 3 plus x plus 4 by 5. Now we need to find the LCM of 3 and 5 because they are unlike fractions. And 3 and 5 are prime numbers. So the LCM of prime numbers would be the product of those numbers. So 3 fives are 15. So 15 is the LCM and we're going to use it as the common denominator. Now 3 fives are 15. That means I need to multiply this whole thing by 5. 
So let's multiply first 5 into x. We multiply 5 into x first. So it is 5x plus 5 into 1 is 5 plus 5 3s are 15. So let's multiply this whole thing by 3. So 3 into x is 3x plus 3 into 4 is 12. So here let's work out the like terms. We have 5x plus 3x. So that is 5x plus 3x is 8x plus. Now let's work out the whole numbers. 5 plus 12. That's 17. 17 divided by 15. So this is what we've got. Let's write it here. So here we have 8x plus 17 divided by 15. This is equal to x minus 4 by 7. So here we're going to transpose a few things. Now I'm going to transpose 7 from the right hand side to the left. So it's going to become multiplication. Here it's division. It's going to become multiplication on the left. So that will be 7 into 8x plus 17. And on the right hand side, I already have x minus 4. I'm going to transpose 15, which is division, from here to the right hand side. It's going to become multiplication. So it is 15 into x minus 4. Now let's open these brackets. So 7 into 8x is what I need to multiply first. 7 8s are 56. That's 56x plus 7 into 17. This 7 into 17. So let's multiply that. 17 into 7. 7 7s are 49. Carry 4. 7 1s are 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So that is 119. So let's write that 119. Now here on the other side, we multiply 15 into x first. 15 into x is 15x minus, multiply 15 into 4. 15 4s are 60. Okay, now we have x on both sides. As you can see, I have x here. On this side, I have 56x. And on the right hand side, I have 15x. So we're going to put the x on one side and the whole numbers on the other side. So let's do that. So let's begin. We're going to keep the x here. So I'm going to keep 56x here. Now I'm going to transpose 15x from the right hand side to the left. So it's going to become minus 15x. Now the whole numbers, I'm going to leave it on the right hand side. So I already have minus 60. Now I'm going to transpose plus 119 to the right hand side it will become minus 119. Now here, 56x minus 15x. Let's work that out and see. 56 minus 15. 6 minus 5 is 1. 5 minus 1 is 4. So that's mine 41. So here we have 41x. This is equal to now here we have minus 60 and minus 119. Signs are the same. So let's put the same sign and add. So 60 plus 119. 9. 6 plus 1 is 7. 1. So that is 179. So now we know the value of 41x. We can find the value of x. x is equal to minus 179 divided by 41. We have transposed this 41 to the right hand side, it has become division. So to find x, we have to divide 171 by 41, 179 by 41. Okay, now let's multiply 41 into 4 and see what we get. 4 ones are 4, 4 fours are 16, 164. So 41 into 4 is 164 minus 9 minus 4 is 5. 7 minus 6 is 1. So that we have 15. So when I make this a mixed number, this becomes 4, 15 by 41. So let's write down that here. So it becomes 4, 15 by 41. Now let's look at the sign here. There we have minus and plus. Minus into plus is minus. So here we found the value of x. x is equal to minus 
4 15 by 41 so this is our answer the final answer is minus 4 15 by 41 present 23 so here we have brackets so let's try and work those brackets first so 15 minus now 2 into 5 2 5s are 10 now 2 minus 2 into 3x minus 3x so minus into minus is plus 2 3s are 6 we've got 6x is equal to on this side also we do the same thing 4 into x first will be 4x then 4 into minus 3 will be minus 4 3s are 12 plus 13 so first let's work out the numbers here so here 15 minus 10 i have 15 minus 10 is 5 so that is 5 plus 6x and on the right hand side also i can work out minus 12 and 13 so 4x i will write as it is here signs are different so we have to put the sign of the bigger number and subtract 13 minus 12 is 1 now as you can see we have x on both sides on the left hand side and the right hand side as well as the constants that is the numbers so let's put them all to one side let's put 6x here and i'm going to transpose 4x to the left hand side it's going to become minus 4x on the right hand side i already have 1 and i'm going to transpose 5 to the right hand side it's going to become minus 5 so here what do we have 6x minus 4x is 2x and here 1 minus 5 so this is plus 1 minus 5 signs are different put the sign the bigger number and subtract 5 minus 1 is 4 so 2x is equal to minus 4 so x will be minus 4 divided by 2 so this is a plus sign so here minus into plus is minus 4 divided by 2 2 2s are 4 so we found the value of x here x is equal to minus 2 so let's get that answer ready so the answer is minus 2 question 24 so here we have a fraction on one side and a mixed number on the other side so let's begin by writing 2x plus 1 by 3x minus 2 equals let's convert this 4 ones are 4 plus 1 5 by 4 now let's transpose numbers from one side to the other side so i'm going to bring 4 from the right hand side to the left hand side it's going to become multiplication so this is going to be 4 into 2x plus 1 on the right hand side now i have 5 left i'm going to transpose 3x minus 2 to the right hand side it's going to go from here to here and it's division here so it's going to become multiplication when it goes to the right hand side so that is 3x minus 2 now let's open the brackets now first i need to multiply 4 into 2x 4 twos are 8 8x plus now i must multiply 4 into 1 so 4 ones are 4 so we finish this side now let's move on to the right hand side first we multiply 5 into 3x 5 threes are 15 so that is 15x now we multiply 5 into minus 2 so that becomes minus 5 twos are 10 now again we have x on both sides and numbers on both sides let's put them all together so here we have 8x and i'm going to transpose 15x from the right hand side to the left it's going to become minus 15x now on the right hand side i already have minus 10 now i'm going to transpose plus 4 to the right hand side it's going to become minus 4 so now let's work this out here signs are different so we need to put the sign of the bigger number which is minus and subtract 15 minus 8 is 7 so minus 7x is equal to here signs are the same so put the same sign and add 10 plus 4 is 14 so minus 7x is equal to minus 14 that means x is equal to 
minus 14 by minus 7. So here we get minus into minus is plus 14 divided by 7 is 2 plus 2. So we have found the value of x here. x is equal to 2. We will stop with that for now. In our next video, we will continue with the remaining questions. Thank you, children.